know it's been a long time since I vlogged, so I figure let's just do it, okay? Let's just do it today. Today is Wednesday, July 6th. <laughs> I'm like, am I going to get this? Um, I'm currently three weeks out, a little more than three. Um, in exactly three weeks, tomorrow I'll be headed to Vegas for my first national show. And I am extremely, extremely, extremely excited. My body has transformed. It's changed a lot since my last show and I'm really, really curious of how I look on stage. Um, I know it's gonna be great. I know that I'm bringing my best absolute package ever and I'm very, very confident in it. And in a national situation, there are 50 other girls who are bringing their best and who are confident in their very best. So we're all battling it out, but wishing everyone the best, but only two go pro. So I want that pro card first show. Like how insane, how insane would that be? But I'm trying really, really hard. Um, these shows are very, very expensive. It's $300 just to register. So I'm trying to do as little national shows as I can <laughs> for money's sake. And I think that um, I have a great um, body for the pro stage. So I'm curious to see what the judges think. So I'm gonna take you guys through my day today. Today's ab day, I have clients. I'm gonna show you what I'm eating all day and I'm gonna do some posing as well to give you guys an update of my physique because I look totally different. I've been working my ass off, doing 50 minutes of cardio every day, doing my circuit training um, for my lifts and just, just killing it. I haven't even been vlogging, I haven't been doing anything, I've literally just been keeping my head down and just fucking working. And it's paid off. And I'm really excited how I'm gonna look in three weeks. Um, I'm doing a practice peak week this week, starting Friday, no Saturday, cheat meal Friday. I had a refeed Sunday. And um, so I'm gonna see how I look on low carbs, low carb cycling. So yeah, that's my little update. Hope you guys enjoy the rest of my video and uh, see you in the next clip. for the day got my makeup on anyway I'm about to have my meal numero dos I'm going to have um, chicken nachos my fave so the sad thing about this meal is that it has a lot of sodium so as I said before I am um, 
I'm cutting, I'm doing a practice peak week this week, which means cutting any added, oh my goodness, like, oh, Jesus, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> anyway, I'm cutting all added salt, so like no sprinkling salt um, out. I don't cut salt all the way completely. So I'll be cutting that on Saturday, and then I will be um, cutting salty food, which means nachos, um, tortilla chips, laughing cow cheese. Um, what else am I cutting? I'm cutting combat crunch bars, and I haven't decided. I don't. I actually, I did cut the cereal. I cut the cereal. Um, I didn't cut Halo Top, though. I kept that in every meal next week, and I'm totally excited. I planned it all yesterday. So, um, yeah, so I'm cutting all the extra stuff. But my meals are still bomb, and I'll show you guys that next week. But, so right now what I'm doing, which you guys, some of you guys have seen and some of you guys haven't, I am, I boil all my chicken together at once, not all of it, but a couple breasts, and then when I'm ready to eat it, I just, it's not seasoned or anything, it's just basic. Um, when I'm ready to eat it, I simply shred it with my hands um, and weigh out how much I want, season it, and saute it a little bit you don't even need to do it that long it's really just heating it up so that it's delicious and that's it and I do this for every chicken meal that I have so that I don't have to cook raw chicken to order every single meal or so that I don't have to meal prep um, any extra anything you know so guys as you guys can see like love salt like, could have salt for life like just love it so I'm just like swimming in it this week until I cut it so that I don't have to <laughs> cut too much. So yeah, simple. Bam! So then you put that on and just like walk away, wait for it to cook. Because all you gotta do is measure out the cheese, measure out the um, chips, and you're good to go. So I did a little makeup today. I'm trying to look all pretty for no reason. I think it turned out good. So yeah, before I start talking about a bunch of stuff that doesn't need to be talked about, I'm going to peace out and show you guys my nachos. And thanks for watching. And uh, yeah. Yeah.
is my, I actually made this a no carb meal because a couple of days ago I was, I went to Denny's on the 4th of July for breakfast and I used up like the majority of my carbs so I had to play around a little bit and ended up like putting together the most beautiful no carb meal and I actually want it you know just just to have it so I'm doing that I added that to my daily well, I added it to yesterday, which was Tuesday, um, so that I can have more Halo Top ice cream at night. So, and this is like a good little, it's not really even a sacrifice, but I pretty much took out my black beans, which I love black beans, but I'm going to have plenty of time to eat my black beans um, when I cut all my like wonderful carbs out that make me bloated. So, um... I'm just gonna do this for now, do my no carb meal. I actually have some peanut butter too. But right now I'm shredding um, four ounces of chicken. And this meal is literally four ounces of chicken, uh, one fourth, or one eighth, one fourth um, bell peppers, and then spinach, cooked spinach, which is just bomb. I love cooked spinach. Um, cook it all together sprinkle some parmesan cheese on top like that's it <laughs> it's super simple like but the taste all of the taste together just like really really just hits the spot and I'm just like mm, that's good I'm gonna eat that every day so now on days that I want to save my um, my carbs for other things I have absolutely no problem doing that you know, this meal is not even a sacrifice. It's just plain delicious. <laughs> so I don't even have to worry. So that's what I'm doing. I'm shredding my chicken. Walking her my food. It is, it's 3, 3.18. I usually eat at 3.30. I have a client at 5 and another one right at, well, at 6.15 so I can eat my, eat again. Um, so I'm going to pack my food, take it to the gym. And eat in between clients, which is what I usually do. So sprinkle, sprinkle all your seasonings because you're crazy and you like flavor. Bam. And then grab your bell pepper and just, just snap some pieces off. <laughs> Super simple. You guys know me, and if you don't know me, you know that I don't like spending hours in the kitchen I don't like cooking forever so all of my meals are fast if you ever see me make anything on YouTube anything here you know that it's gonna take less than 10 minutes unless I say so and just know that they're fast they're quick and people who are like oh I can't eat healthy I can't meal prep whatever take it's easy just do it like it's super fast like I don't go into crazy depth about like some lots and lots of ingredients just mixed together I just I just don't so that's it so you're gonna let the, the chicken cook a little and then you're gonna add the spinach towards the end and I'll show you guys a cute little picture so while I have you um, while I have you I think that by the time you guys see this, it'll be closed, but I'll still put the link below. Um, I'm having a online four-week transformation training challenge. I need to build up my portfolio of my online um, clients and because I, I just launched online training. I've been a personal trainer for three years, but I'm starting online training so that you guys can see me all over the world. So, if... The challenge is closed. You can book me online at bodiesbymel.com and you can still be my client. But right now I'm doing a transformation for only 10 people. 10 people, 8 weeks, $150 each person. Super cheap. I mean, it's a huge discount. And the winner gets $200. A goodie box of a bunch of fitness stuff. So, like, I'm going to throw in some combat crunch bars. All of my favorite, favorite stuff along with Evagen Nutrition products. And you will also win, of course, your own transformation and beautiful body. 
each single person gets their own progress, their own um, check-ins, their own program. Everything is all, all custom. I am not a cookie cutter person. I don't do that to my clients. I don't copy and paste um, client to client. You know, everyone has different goals. So um, just know that. Um, by the time I post this, I hope that at least 10 people have signed up. I'm about to post it on Instagram, but I already did it on Lifting Ladies. I already did it on Melafit Facebook. I blogged about it, and you know, it's all out there. So hopefully 10 people join. But if not, if the register, if you click on the link and the registration is still open, then you still have time. If not, then you can wait until the next eight week challenge, which will be in September, or you can just book me online as an online client. Um, yeah, so thank you guys for watching. I'm gonna finish cooking. And yeah, I'll show you my beautiful meal. Okay, so I forgot to mention that I actually do put 14 grams of fat-free mozzarella on my um, chicken and spinach and bell peppers. I mean, that's what makes it good as well. So you're going to shake that around, let the um, spinach get withered a little, and then you're going to sprinkle the cheese on top. Put the lid on top, let it smother, and then put it on the plate, and then Parmesan. I actually use fat-free mozzarella for three meals, which I just realized, but there's no fat in the, it's nine grams of protein and two grams of carbs, so it's bomb. You know, usually cheese doesn't have carbs, but obviously being non-fat, they had to put something in there, so, which sounds kind of weird, but that's just the way it is. Um, yeah, I'll show you guys Hey guys, <laughs> so I'm in between clients right now and totally chewing. You gotta eat when you can. Combat Crunch birthday cake. Unfortunately, I have to cut these out next week because they do make me bloated, but not too much. There's just so much fiber in it. And then cinnamon toast crunch together the best like so good so I scheduled with one client ran to the gym so that I can buy more combat crunch bars absolutely ridiculous and so now I'm running back to my gym so I can train another girl who happened to be late that's why I had time so I'm like yes thank you <laughs> so I'm gonna eat drive home to my gym and uh, I'll check in back with you guys later for my night meal for my um, last two meals I have two meals after this so peace out which is what I'm doing these days because of my shins they they just hurt so can't do running anymore it's really really sad so I've been doing the elliptical it's a pretty good workout though I always break a sweat and I'm always like I do super high resistance and um, 
So it's great. It's like hiking. So I did 25 minutes of that and then a two minute cool down and then I did 30 minutes, um, like a 30 minute ab workout, which was super good. It was awesome. I was going to shoot some, but there were like a lot of people in the gym and it's like a private gym, so I didn't want to be all weird. So that's well, okay. I got a little tiny bit of posing. It's like kind of awkward lighting and weird, but I lifted up my shirt and I had veins in my abs and I was trying to get it on camera but of course as always I can never get it I can never catch it <laughs> it's so annoying I seriously wake up in the middle of the night and have um veins going up my abs insane I'm just like ah so lean but yeah I'm gonna shower and um I'm gonna shower and then have my tacos and then I'm gonna have my halo top meal um, I saved room for two servings today, so awesome, and one, one thin Oreo, and then it's bedtime, so that's it, that's my night, but I'll show you guys my tacos, uh, that I eat every single night and have been eating every night for, like, the past two years, like, besides cheat days, like, for real, they're so good, and Halo Top, if you haven't tried them, like, get on it, it seriously tastes like real ice cream. But it's only 70 freaking calories, and it's just like, how is this possible? How is this healthy? But it is, and it's good, and I'm going to show you guys, which I'm sure you've seen it already. I mean, they're all, it's fitness people, like, dominate that. They're like, it's everywhere. Duh. So, yeah, I will see you guys in the next clip.